Hi friends, Jen here, and today we are talking about a topic that I love. But unfortunately, it was a topic that I didn't really get to experience as a new mom. And I think that's why I love it, because I love sharing knowledge about it. So let's talk about baby wearing. So I firmly believe that baby wearing is for everybody. And that is really important to me. As you know, I'm a plus size mother, and I um, really only review and talk about products that I would love and I would use and that fit my body. And so, because of that, I'm really excited to be talking about Baby Tula today. And why I'm really excited is because they are a size friendly company um, for baby wearing and baby carriers. Um, and this really became clear to me when I, whenever I do a post on the Plus Mommy Facebook page about plus size baby wearing and what is your favorite carrier and where did you get it? And it's like, baby Tula, baby Tula, baby Tula. <laughs> so when they reached out to me, I was like, heck yes, I would love to review a carrier and, um, and get my hands on it. So I'm really excited to have this opportunity. But I'll, I'll share a story, you know, when I had my son seven years ago, almost seven years ago, how did that happen? Um, but when my son was a little newborn, um, it was a pain in the neck, right? Having the stroller that the car seat fit into and you had to, like all these contraptions and it was just, it was a lot, right? A lot to handle. So my friend talked to me about baby wearing and I just assumed that that was something that I couldn't do as a plus size mom, like a very plus size mom, right? And so I went to like one of these poshy posh um, baby stores where you can get all your cloth diapers, which a lot of these stores are really wonderful and the people who work there are really nice, but I felt like I happened to go to the one place where they had just never seen a mom my size before. And they were kind, I mean they weren't mean to me, but they were recommending a carrier that I don't even think business is in business anymore, but it was not a lot of fabric, not a lot of give for a hundred dollars. But I so desired to fit in. And I think that that's kind of the story of this fat girl's life growing up in Southern California, right? Like I so wanted to do what all the cool kids were doing. And I, you know, I didn't fit in the clothes at what seal. I was at Lane Bryant next door. So, um, but I, you know, I tried to squeeze into some. So I tried to squeeze into this baby carrier and I spent a hundred dollars and it was so tight that I would wear like sweaters, right? So I would put my son in the carrier and then it would crisscross and sorry, scissors for unboxing, but there was like so much back fat like smooshed in with these straps that A, my back would hurt really bad very quickly, and B, like I had to wear a sweater over the carrier, which is just ridiculous. So I share all of this with you to say that because of that, and because of that experience, and because of spending $100 to wear something like three times, um, once I started blogging and really becoming more educated, I put together a resource for plus size baby wearing and I work with companies like Baby Tula to show you carriers that are size friendly and work for moms of all shapes and size and dads and partners and grandmas and grandpas and sisters and brothers um, and that's really really important to me. So I really want to encourage you to baby wear if that's something that you want. There is nothing more wonderful than snuggling and coddling your baby, but there's also the need to like, you know, walk around and <laughs> read a book and, you know, be able to do stuff, um, do the dishes, maybe not cook, probably not the best idea, but you can do some food prep, um, but to have your baby on you, that bonding is um, really something that is so special and so needed and, and so healing. I will say that for me, having him close, even though I couldn't have the carrier, um, I kept him that close for so long because breastfeeding was such a struggle for us. So I've heard from other moms that really love baby wearing because it gives you this this closeness and this connection and just this ease. Like you don't have to pull out the stroller and the other stuff. It just makes life a lot easier. So here we go. Let's look at Baby Tula. 
So I have not opened this, which is kind of fun. Unboxings are always fun. Like, it's kind of like Christmas, but I know what's inside, so you guys just get to get surprised by the pattern. So here we go. I'm like, afraid I don't want to hurt the carrier. So I picked this carrier because um, it's summertime, you guys, and it is really warm. So the perk about this carrier is it has this panel here that I'll show you that is breathable. And I think that that's something that I get questions about a lot during the hotter months. Like, yeah, baby wearing is wonderful, but you, it can get a little warm in there, right? All right, so here we go. So pretty. I'll show you. So this is the toddler, and I also wanted to do the toddler one because um, it's Coast Fox Gloves is the name of it. And I pulled up my little handy phone here um, with the link because I'm a mom and I have mom brain and I can't memorize all of this. But it's the Coast Fox Glove Tula Toddler Carrier. So I wanted to do two things in this review when they were like, pick a carrier, and I was like, oh, this is fun. Now, can I pick a baby to go in the carrier? Okay. Um, I wanted something that was a toddler carrier because I think that's another thing that I was completely unaware of when I was looking into baby wearing. I thought it was just for newborns, but, you know, <laughs> you think, like, when a baby turns one, then they're old, and they're not. They're still so little and needy and cuddle. And then when they're two, they're, they still need that connection and closeness. And... You know, when you've been at the zoo for a while, walking around, they get exhausted, so pop them on your back um, with a back carry on it. Um, that is an awesome way to connect and have fun. And what's great with these structured carriers is that they're designed ergonomically so that your back isn't going to be hurting like ones that you're trying to squeeze into that don't really work. So what this carrier, it can be used from about 18 months, which there's still so little and cute at that age, um, all the way to four years, which is when they learn how to back talk. Um, so maybe it's good to, to have them close. Remind them, remind yourself why you love them. No, I know we love our children, but um, it will hold babies between 25 and 60 pounds, which is really awesome. And um, with the beginning, the child needs to be a minimum of uh, 32 inches tall. So, um, yeah, I think that this is really exciting and I'm gonna open it up for you. So it's got extra padding, it is uh, breathable and lightweight and that was what I was really excited because it's summertime, y'all. It's getting pretty hot around here, so I don't know about you. Um, yeah, so and I will share all of these great details within the link below as well. So let's get to the fun part and let's see it, right? And I do apologize that I was unable to get a baby to put in it today. But what I am going to show you is photographs of plus size mom's baby wearing from Baby Tula. So you can see that it really, they really are a wonderful brand. Oh, their tagline is keep doing what you love. I love that. I know so many moms that baby wear for so many years and for them it's part of their bonding and connection and I just think that's so incredibly beautiful and wonderful. So let's look at this. I know all you baby wearing experts watching this is like, she's doing it wrong. I'm just kidding. Oh, I wish you guys could feel these straps. Like, for real. I Like, backpacks aren't this thick. And they should be. Because it's so thick and comfy. But look at this. And look at this material. Isn't it gorgeous? Yeah. Oh, there we go. Now it's... Look at that. And then, so it has this breathable. And if you can see, my hand is right here. So it's really nice. And then it's got like the little cap area too. So the baby or the toddler can be on you. I'll let it adjust back. Come on. Okay, here we go. And they've got that little sunshade too. So yeah, and then let me get the band here. 
So it goes out, I mean, it keeps going and going and going. So there's a lot of room going on here. I'll post the measurements as well. I'll probably post them right here. But if I just, I mean, why aren't seatbelts on airplanes this long? Um, Baby Tula, will you please reach out to like Southwest and United Airlines and teach them a thing or two? So yeah, I mean, this is, this is massive. So if we look at, here's where it could go on your front or your back, it's upside down, right here. And then we've got this big strap. And then, straps here. So yeah, for a carry, for a front carry, I would just put here, and then, sorry you guys, I'm, all, I'm just really short, but you're going to bring it around. Okay, I'm going to show you. And snap. Just show you guys that it snaps, right? So, <laughs> I don't know if you can tell, I'm sorry. And I'm sitting and it snapped. I think that was really important for me to show you that it is truly size friendly. Um, I've gained some weight. <laughs> so I would say that I'm definitely like a 26, 28 these days um, with size. And then this is, I mean, that's incredible, right? That it is fitting around my waist and it is comfortable, like sitting down, standing up, belly out <laughs> like it's comfortable I think the only thing that I am missing now obviously is to do the back straps but I I know there are ways to do it without help but oh here there we go um and then there would be a baby right and it would need to be adjusted properly but um yeah, the only thing missing is a tiny little baby, so um, Tula, I'm going to be talking to my husband now because I really think that um, I need a baby to put in here, but I'm really comfortable. I, um, I don't feel smushed. I feel like I could definitely go out in public and rock this and feel confident and feel comfortable. So there you have it, my friends. This is the Tula um, baby carrier. I'm really happy with it. I think it's adorable too. And um, I just, I really, really want to thank them for sharing this with me. Um, I love the breathable fabric. Perfect for summer, warmer weather, or just someone who gets really hot. Um, I think it'd be a great option. And the fact that it's a to uh, toddler carrier as well, and just really talking about the fact that baby wearing goes well beyond infancy. Um, and that our kids love to snuggle and love to be close to us. And that this provides the opportunities um, for going out in public and having them and being hands free. Like, woo, I can, I can be on my phone and look up anything I want, right? So I'm going to pull up my friends here at Baby Tula. So it's just Baby Tula, B-A-B-Y-T-U. Uh, LA.com and I will provide links and um, happy baby wearing to you all. Take care. We'll talk again soon. Bye.